Hey everyone, I haven't done a video in a while, so I figured I'd do one. Um, I have quite a lot of cards to show. I've posted a few pictures um, on the forum, but some cards I haven't shown yet. So let's get into it. Um, oh, and I'm going to show, I have a complete set. Um, it's pretty much as complete as it's going to be, like, even upgrades, it'll, I don't think I'll be able to upgrade one for a while, so, it's pretty much as complete as it's going to be for at least a year or two. Um, first I'm going to go into the bigger cards, and bigger I mean size-wise. Um, first, this one's more of a filler. I'd like to get in a higher grade, but I got it real cheap, so. 1970 Super, Floyd Little. PSA 7. Sorry about the glare. These ones I submitted to PSA. Um, primarily for this one card I needed. 1982 Broncos Police. Randy Grabshar. And this is only the second card graded. This was... I lost this in an auction. And it was a PSA 9. And the guy that won it has the number one master set. So he went ahead and added that. So I had all, I would bought the set, the 82 Broncos Police set ungraded a while back. And I just never really great, got them graded until now. I won. Cash. Damn dog's not allowed in the kitchen. Um, 1982, this the next two I got graded because I needed them for a master set also, but I didn't need them. They weren't in the set, but I figured I might as well add them. So, 1982 Broncos Police, Lewis Ray. Lewis Master Set, first one graded. So, PSA 8, not higher. Break up church, PSA 8, first graded. And that was for his master set also. And this one, I wanted to pick out one more. Um, I like, I had actually a few to choose from. Because I had bought four, uh, if you remember, I had bought four graded previously. And so I'm trying to put the set together now since I'm almost halfway done. So I went ahead, I've met him a few times at some Broncos alumni events, and he's actually a real nice guy, so uh, went ahead and got his graded, Bill Thompson, PSA 8, top one, none higher. So now I have eight for the set, I think I have seven more to go, so it's a work in progress. I got a package in, yes, well, actually I'll go through the ones I've already posted, but haven't shown on video. 2013 Panini Prism, Monte Bell, PSA 10. These, all these I got real cheap. 2013 Panini Certified, Monte Ball, PSA 10. 2013 Tops Magic, Monte Ball, PSA 10. That all these I got actually really cheap. These I got for like four dollars. It's ridiculous. 2013 Panini Rookie Stars. Peyton Manning. PSA 10. 2013 Panini Score. Peyton Manning. Air Mail. PSA 10. And then 2013 Panini Scores. PSA 10. Cash. And then this one is for, it's a non Bronco card, oh my god. Uh, 1959, Jim Parker. I got this actually real cheap. For some reason, I got it for less than 20 bucks, so I was really happy about that. The ridiculous thing is, I only found two other ones graded at the time when I bought this on eBay, and they're both by it now. In the seven, they wanted like $85, and for an eight, they wanted $100 something dollars. 
I thought that was ridiculous. Got this for less than 20. <laughs> I'm happy. Hey. Then yesterday's package, I got, uh, actually, this one also for the Lewis right set. Got this real cheap. Just put in an offer and he took it. So, 1987 tops, Lewis right. PSA 10. For the Master AM basic set. And then I got these in yesterday. No, I take that back. This one I got in a couple days ago. And it's just an upgrade. It was when they, that 1979 top set broke, or they broke up the set. So, Riley Odoms, PSA 10. And then, I also got a grass char, but I'm going to go through that here in a minute. I got these in last night, um, four sharp corners. I just picked it up, whatever. 1976 Otis Armstrong. When they first posted this, it was like, they weren't like $40 or $50. And as you know, with four sharp corners, if you wait long enough, they'll drop the price. So I got this for like 11 they kept dropping the price more and more. So, happy with that purchase. This is for the Hall of Fame set. Um, 1989 score. Bruce Matthews. Getting, I try to, if I buy from like Four Sharp Corners or Propstein or any of those, um, if I pick up a bunch of Broncos, I'll try to get like one Hall of Famer just to get a little variety in my set. Alright, so this is the set I'm talking about. It's about as complete as I'm going to get it. So I'm going to go through it. I got the last one last night with the four sharp corners. So, 1976, Randy Grashar, PSA 9. And I Saw this go on auction. There was a PSA 10 that went on auction a couple months back. It went for like more than I can afford right now. Maybe later. It was like $350 or something. And I thought that was a little much for a one point upgrade. 1977 Tops. Crash R. I think there's 10 PSA 10s. Don't, don't quote me on that. Next, I got this with the Lewis Wright uh, card I just showed. 1978 Tops Randy Grass Shark PSA 10. I put in an offer. He took it. I honestly didn't think he would. I thought he'd like counter offer, but I'm happy. This one is part of the 79 set they broke up. So, 79 Grass Shark PSA 10. Tops, Randy Grash Art, PSA 10. And almost all of these, honestly, I picked up within the last couple of days, or a couple of weeks, at least with the PSA 10s. Because I got the 78 recently, got the 79 recently, got this one recently, got this one recently. Actually, I got, I think I got this one last night. 81 tops, PSA 10. And then 82 tops, PSA 10. And this one is a pop of 7. And so I bought it off four sharp corners. It dropped the price like twice. And then I'm like, okay. And then they had sale, so I picked it up. Again, pop of 7. I didn't think it would happen. Immediately. And this one, 1983, PSA 10. This one's easy to find. It's like the cheapest one. So, that's about as complete as that's going to get for a while. Because 76 and 77 are the hardest two to get in 10s. Or at least to find, per se. And so, I think...
No, I picked up another one two days ago from the Hall of Fame set. That one will be in here soon. And I think that's all I have. Oh, I was at a bookstore. And I found this. I haven't even seen this ever. And it's actually a pretty new book, so it's actually pretty neat to pick up. Denver, the Broncos, and coming of age, 77. It's about the 1977 Broncos when they made it to their first Super Bowl. So, yeah, Randy Gradshaw, Ada Moses, Craig Morton, Kyle Lanzada, and Red Miller. So, I'm looking forward to reading that when I get time. Right now, I really don't. I'm working two jobs, keeping busy, planning weddings. It's ridiculous. So, that's all I have for right now. Hope everyone else is having a good month um, for auctions. I've actually picked up some real good ones. God, I cannot for the life of me. I know I, I'm so tired right now. Um, I picked up one for the Hall of Fame set at a real good price. I cannot remember <laughs> which one it was. I know it's from 78. That's all I remember. I'm sorry, I'm tired. Just got off work. Um, yeah, so I'm going to try and cut back next month on buying cars because I went kind of crazy this month. But I make no guarantees. So, hope all is well. Talk to you later.